Hey, you awesome, wonderful, blessed, excited, ignited people. I want to declare goodness over you today. And I want to just encourage you a little bit today uh, to be God conscious, not sin conscious. Conscious, 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 sin conscious. <laughs> so, guys, I want to just declare it over you today. And that, um, you know what, your sin, your lack of whatever it is, you like to look at yourself, you're not good enough, and I'm still doing this stuff, and, and God is not going to bless me because I am still doing the wrong thing and whatever, and you're feeling condemned, and like, um, I can't pray, I can't read my Bible because I feel so bad, and all, all those wonderful things, and you know what, um, uh, I can't stop eating that chocolate cake and every time I say I'm not, I'm going to do it even more and now I'm not going to get my blessing and blah, 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 blah. All of these things. Uh, I want to say to you, when you feel that way, it's good. It's good. When you feel that way, like, yes, I feel not nice in my, you know, I'm struggling a little bit here. Oof, you know, it's like, uh, it's a good place to be. It means you have remorse, which is amazing, which is awesome. You know what? You don't just sin because sin is okay. You just sin and you just do things because, okay. Because, you know, we do things willfully. Yes, you do willful sin. I want that chocolate cake and that's my chocolate cake and I'm taking that chocolate And I'll think, well, why did I take that chocolate cake? Why? That's a good place to be. So I want to say to you this morning that uh, uh, it's good to be in that way. But, but, I want you to hear but. I want to tell you this morning that your sin is not yours. In other words, I want to say to you, don't own up to your sin. What do you say? Yes, don't own up your sin. That sin is not yours. What? Yes, that sin that you do is not yours. I don't understand. What do you mean? I did it. No, no. The Bible says that he paid the price for your sin. He took your infirmities, your sickness, your disease, your sin, your everything. Your, he took it upon himself. He bought your sin. Cast all your cares upon him so he can take care of you. So cast all your sin, your habits, your addictions on him. Let him take care of it. Yeah, but you hard work. Nope, don't own up on it. Don't own up on it. There's a different law, my members. Who will deliver me from this body of death? Thanks be to Jesus Christ. He has delivered you from sin, sickness, disease, death, poverty. He's delivered you from that habit, addictions, whatever. Come on, man. Get over yourself. Start focusing on God. Whatever you focus on, you'll steer towards. Steer and focus towards God. Focus towards God. You'll steer towards God. I'm holy. I'm blameless. I'm spotted. Oh, I messed up. Oh, God is your sin. I'm separating myself from this because it's not who I am. You. Who are you? Who are you? You are holy, blameless, spotless. This is who you are. Separate yourself from sin. Don't take up, don't take up response. Oh, it's my sin. No, don't own up your response. Don't own up your sin. Please give it to the Lord. So, Lord, I recognize that I messed up. That's fine. But it's not mine. It's yours. Lord, you, the work that you started in me, you will complete. Not me. You will complete. I do what I can. Try to put in boundaries. Try to not do those things. Lord knows. You know, and we always have this sin about what's the greatest sin, uh, you know, uh, sexual morality, drinking, drugs, whatever. But what about the sin of the heart? Anger, malice, um, you know, unforgiveness, bitterness, self-pity, gossiping, huh? um, being a bit vindictive, getting happy when somebody else gets hurt or your enemy gets hurt or somebody else. That's wrong. That's also not good. So, Lord, forgive me and I give it to you, Lord. This part of my heart, I give it to you. This heart issue is the... It's the real things of the heart, Lord, I give it to you. Because I'm, this is not who I am. This is not how you made me to be. I'm not born to be like this ugly person. I want to declare it over you this morning. So I want to declare this morning that you are holy, blameless, and spotless. Man. That's who you are. Flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of God. So God sees you as holy and spiritual, all of this stuff. That's how he sees you. So when he sees you like that, automatically your flesh, your sarcas, has been glorified. Your body has been you're sanctified. That's because of Jesus. Because He was sanctified, so He sanctified you in the spirit and in the natural. Because now knowing this, man, I don't want to do the things I I I I, I, I don't want to I, I don't want to just sin. I just but if I do mess up, Lord, there's grace. But Lord, I thank you. I don't just rely on the grace, Lord. I thank you, and grace empowers me not to do the things that I shouldn't do. But I'm divorcing myself from this. This is not who I am. 
I'm not a sexual immoral person. I'm not a drunkard. I'm not a habit. I don't have addiction. I, this is not who I am. Uh, you know, I'm not, um, you know, uh, bitterness person. I'm not a person that's not unforg that, that unforgiveness in my heart or hatred in my heart or envy or whatever. Lord, this is not who I am. I give it to you. Lord, uh, this is not, you bought this. You bought all my sins, you know, visible or invisible in my heart. You bought that price. I give it back to you. You bought it with a price. So I want to declare it over you this, this morning. Declare God's goodness, faithfulness, and kindness over you. The work that He started in you, He will complete. Amen. In your face with my... So yes. Guys, be blessed. I want to tell you this morning. Man, God love you. He smarks you more than you ever think or even hope or even dream of. God's all your cares upon Him. All your sins, whatever. That you struggle with Him. He said, Lord, you are my faithful daddy. You are my faithful daddy, you know. Um, I can't save myself. You save me, you know. My faith cannot, cannot rescue me. Your, I've got faith in you. Your faith will, is rescuing me. Your faith in you will change me. Not my own faith in myself. Your faith. Lord, I thank you. What you started in me, you will complete. I want to declare that over you this morning. So you guys love you. Bless you. Have a great, awesome, magnificent day. In Jesus' name. And uh, yeah. Give me a shout out, man. And uh, guys, thank you for all your blessings and thank you for all your prayers. Thank you for all the financials uh, that you guys are sowing into my life, into our ministry. I really pray and thank you for every cent that you sow. It will just increase into your life. And I declare all the prayers, all the encouragement. Man, thank you guys. You guys are awesome. You are stunning, man. Love you guys. See you guys soon. Connect with me on YouTube and, and Facebook and also on the WhatsApp and videos and so forth. But guys, love you. Sayonara. Path to your hand out. Love you guys. Have a good day.